to my YouTube channel. Yes, finally. Oh my gosh. Wow. Guys, this has been so long overdue. Wow. I've been meaning to start a channel for so long, but yes, me. Let's not even go there. <laughs> Because, wow, we're just going to take a whole day talking about it. Because, honestly, there were a lot of things. But finally, we are here now. And I think that's what's important. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, so without any further waste of time, let's get into the video. Let's get into the business of the day. Um, so I asked people on my Instagram to ask me questions anything at all and i got quite a few questions that i'll try to answer like i'll try answering all of them and while i answer i'll have my mini fruit bowl and my drink that is like almost done <laughs> yeah so the first question says first of all congratulations on the channel when did you decide to start your channel and what inspired it so i think I decided on my second year of varsity that I wanted to start a YouTube channel, but you know, there's been a lot of things holding me back. Yeah, also a lot of people have been telling me that, oh, you would be a great YouTuber, girl, just do it. And all of that, those people are the ones that inspired me, honestly, to start this YouTube channel and just, you know, the second question says three first date questions that are essential to you. Um, firstly, I would like to know your long term goals. Not that now I am like invading your privacy and all of that, but I want to know because I wouldn't really want to be with someone who doesn't have like a goal. Yeah, and I mean that they aspire to reach one day. And all of that. Also, I would want to know if you have a kid or not. I mean, baby mama drama is a thing. And we cannot avoid those chats. Like, I want to know if you have a child or not. And then we can continue. <laughs> also, with that question, I want to know how's the, if you have a child. I want to know how's the relationship with your baby mama, with your child, with the other family, which is your baby mama's family and all of that and third one would be i don't know i don't have a third question <laughs> the third question says are you a romantic i am a hopeless a hopeless i am a hopeless romantic yo guys i am a hope like I can't even elaborate more. I think my expression elaborates it. I am a hopeless romantic. Wow. <laughs> um, the fourth question says, what are your aspirations in life? Yo, um, I think my aspirations in life are to be happy, to be at peace, you know, and to be successful in all ways possible. I think there is no one that doesn't aspire to be successful one day. I think we all want to be, you know, there, man, at the top, yo. <laughs> the fifth question says, um, are you an introvert or extrovert? So clearly this is someone that just started following me because everyone else knows that yes, Pepe shame, I am just an extrovert extroverted extrovert <laughs> i am just an extrovert nothing more to say on that the next question says do you believe in the 50 50 or 80 20 ratio in a relationship hey tricky very tricky <laughs> i think i believe in the 50 50 honestly because now women and men are equally capable of doing anything back in the day it was very different because men are the only ones that were supposed to work and all of that but now men we're all equal so i feel like i believe in the 50 50 50 50 all the way 
uh the next one says heels or sneakers um i think i'm a sneaker person only because when i wear heels because i'm so tall i feel so insecure i feel like i'm a giant <gasps> i feel like honestly i feel like i'm a giant um so that's why i prefer sneakers over heels but if i was shorter i think i would have been a heel person i would have been a heel person The next one says favorite meal of the day also dish um favorite meal of the day has to be breakfast not because it's the most important meal of the day but because you know what yeah you shy a breakfast <laughs> i make the best breakfast if i have to say that myself i make the best 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 breakfast ever <laughs> And my favorite dish, um, I love seafood. So anything with fish or mussels or prawns or whatever in it is my favorite dish. Next question says, um, what's your biggest peeve? Like, what's the one thing you don't like about yourself? that i am too loving i know i know this will sound weird but i am too loving man and people tend to take advantage of that so i think i don't like that about myself i hate that i love so much <laughs> that sounds a bit off but i hate that i love so much the next question says um whatsapp or instagram youtube <laughs> i'm kidding i think i love instagram more and what's it i mean but i love instagram more the next question says what is your type skinny or buff this has to be a guy <laughs> asking for a friend or asking for himself <laughs> Honestly, I don't have a type, man. The minute I gel with someone, obviously, there are deal breakers, but the moment we gel, I overlook all of those things. So I can't say my type is skinny, dark, handsome, whatever, and all of that. But obviously, there are deal breakers. Yeah. The next question says, what advice would you give to your 10 years old self? that baby girl you need to stop listening to what people say and do whatever the hell you want <laughs> i'm kidding but on the real though um i think at that age i was a bit like you know being valeligile man and i was scared of doing a lot of things because i was listening to everyone's opinion and I think that's also what I'm struggling with now as well. But now I feel like it's better than back then. Yeah. Next question says, what are your toxic traits? I only have one, Shin. Like, I only have one. And that is, I find it hard to apologize. Guys, I have a problem with apologizing. Even when I'm wrong, even when I'm wrong, like, I find it so hard to apologize. Like, oh, yo, So, the next question says, do you have any siblings? If yes, how many? So, I have three brothers and one little sister. But let me tell you something. My parents separated a long time ago and my father had other kids in that other relationship with my mom i just have two brothers and they are way older than me i'm the last born with my mother next question says what is your favorite motivational quote tough times never last only tough people last <laughs> i'm kidding my favorite motivational quote um 
it says your only limitation is your imagination yeah um so let me just take the last question i lost it oh there um this person is asking what are you currently studying so i am doing my bachelor's degree in business administration at rosebank college i'm doing my last year yay finally whoa guys it's been a roller coaster ride like wow it's been a lot hey school is just the ghetto but so we've come to the end of the video thank you so 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 much for tuning in and watching this video please 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 subscribe like this video and comment down below on what you would like to see from me going further bye